title two seasons ago and Sekakuni United are the defending first division champions. They meet today at the Emirates Airline Park in Johannesburg. It's good to have you with us though for this encounter. It should be a classic one between these two sides who played in round 10 on the 7th of November. Sekakuni United winning over Swallows by one goal to nil on the day. And it was Mpunafuti Umalo, aside from Ajax Cape Town, who scored the only goal of that match. Sekakuni United, six on the table coming into this encounter. Chance to go second above Orlando Pirates if they win by a two-goal margin. Nice little touch through the middle here for Monopule Seleng, and they are offering a bit of space now, yeah. Swallow suddenly. The header will find its way to Maklati, does it? No, it doesn't from Masonda. I'm not sure if Maklati was that committed. Huizo well, certainly is committed. Oh, that's an off-the-ball incident from Letla Pika. Well, I'm not quite uh, convinced that I wasn't delivered. And if it is, the referee needs to take some serious action because the body looks as almost dead. Yeah, it's an off-the-ball incident. And uh, Ohizu has gone down. Yeah, I think that was naughty and unnecessary there from Letla Pika. Just trying to get in the way. Pachi looking for Justice Chabalala in the middle of that penalty area. Justin Shonga's in there as well. But yeah, it's a good save from Tella Tella. He's had to be wide awake this afternoon, Tella Tella, and that's exactly what he's been. Very assertive in that six yard area, commanding it and putting off the sides. Once again, a brilliant delivery there. Nice and low. Just needed a touch there. Brilliant delivery from Pachi. Little pick up from Justice Chabalada. Headed away by Bassett. He doesn't know where the ball is, though. Pachi gets the better of him. He's a dangerous player, Pachi. And back in defense is Solomons to save the day, but ooh, it looks a bit messy for a moment. Swallows have gotten away with it. There was a little bit unfortunate there for Bassadin, just an unsighted there. The ball just clashing in between them. Tried to recover there, but Pachi. Sharper to react, and the Solomon's clearing up for his side. And Pachi, very consistent. Tato Maklati not able to pull the ball back. Slid opportunity though. Not clear of the line. Masonda scores. Or is it an own goal? It doesn't matter. The Birds have got one over the line. Finally, it's the 11th goal of the season, and it is to be Premiership. Well, there'll be a lot of happiness there. Big contribution from Musonda. I thought he'd actually lost possession. And Mac Makubedu cannot believe it. A little bit scrappy there from the defence of Sikakuna. Has to be said against the run of play there, but it's all smiles. Makati and Lobo and Musonda. He's going to be looking to claim that. Well, Dylan Kerr knows there's a lot of work still to be done. So it's Makati there down the line. It's not giving up. Continue. With the pressure they ran to the byline pulled it back there nicely from Masonda. i think he did get the toe poke there it was the goalkeeper they got a hand to it but Masonda, the striker's instinct there toe poking it and uh, certainly to his credit they tried to clear it off the line there Kabwe. it was Masonda that got his side the lead Pele looking for something more and Zapata saves and mcclatchy nearly picks up coupe recovered from that injury from the challenge that came from Sien Ledwaba. Cross inside from Mbele. Swallows looking at a different side suddenly. That's what goals do, but Sabata comes up with the goods this time around. Oh, yes, opportunity. Swallows had earlier there. Brilliant work there from Ndobo, just cutting inside and uh, a little too high for the goalkeeper. You could see what he wanted to do with it. Don't poke it in the far post, but uh, what a save there from Sabata. Bele, chased down by Chavalala, Maklatsi, first time ball, way by Lidwaba, this is good pressure from Swallows, exactly what the Dubé Bird supporters would want, oh, keepers come out and missed it, and Swallows have missed the chance as well with the man we were just talking about, Ketukatuna and Glavu, Predator's instincts were required there. Stanton Fredericks didn't come from the youngster. Anticipation needed there. Expect the ball to fall to you. Couldn't uh, react quickly. Assume that the goalkeeper would handle it there in global. Hmm. 
Well, there's a bit of nervousness about Sekakuni United suddenly. It's only the 13th goal of the season that they've conceded. We'll drop their goal difference down to plus three and keep them in sixth position. So, Tantani and Chumayelo is about to come on. Yeah, this is an opportunity that fell to Ndlova. You could see it for the goalkeeper would get to it. Just couldn't make it come. What a golden opportunity for Swallows to get their second and uh, get a cushion goal. It wasn't to be. It was easier to miss there for Ndlova. So then putting the ball in the box there. Goalkeeper in sixes and sevens. Goal gaping and Ndlova could not put it over the line. Hit away. Comes from Mbwapi Masonda, the goal scorer. This is Pachi, however. He's got a good shot at him, Pachi. Was it crossbar or was it Teratella? It's Teratella. Good save. A brilliant save there. It was Pachi that uh, he knew he was going to go on to his right hand side. See this. Chumayelo just beaten it. He knew exactly what he wanted to do. What a ferocious shot there. Back to March, and they're being industrious here. Sekakuni United. Little touch in there from Evans Rusike. Mart can dig them from this range. It's not a bad effort. Keeper just a little bit on the back foot. I think he's done nicely, Tella Tella. What a brilliant save there, but uh, you called it. Mart can be dangerous from that range. What a strike from Mart from a standing position. Managed to get so much dip and power on it. Uh, Tella, look at that. From a standing position, what a shot and what a save. That was a great opportunity. And down the other side, and Pele's done nicely. This is Coupe. Don't just call penalties, Coupe. Pele. Hamilton could save Toaster. Out of nowhere. He's a goal scorer, though. He's Hamilton. And Lobo's done well here. Just waited for assistance, and Hamilton just uh, sneaking from behind. Unsighted there. Coupe done well just to lay in the path of Lobo. This is where there was no opportunity or many in the box and uh, Hamadine just sneaking in there trying to squeeze it in the near post and what a save from Sabata. Beautiful piece of delivery. It only takes one goal in the game of football to pick up all three points and that's what happened for Swallows today as they beat Zekakuni United by one goal to nil.